Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is for Friday, June 14th. I'm James Spann. Dry weather continues across Alabama today, but moist air comes back Sunday with a chance of scattered showers and storms by then. Let's check things out this morning. A very deep upper trough over the eastern states. That's the reason it feels so good. Yeah, look at the numbers. Coleman 50. These are at 430. Inevitably, we're going to hear of some upper 40s in some of the colder pockets. Fort Payne 51. Haleyville 52. Gadsden 53. It'll be a bright sunny day today with highs up in the mid 80s. The humidity will stay low. Very quiet around the nation this morning. That's the watch warning map. Later, severe storms possible for parts of the Great Plains down into West Texas. Tomorrow, again, the chance of severe storms out across the heartland. Maybe a few scattered storms for the southwestern part of the state. Then on Sunday, day three, a risk of severe storms from North Texas up to near Pittsburgh and close to Washington, D.C. And again, for us, no severe weather, but there could be a few scattered storms statewide on Sunday. Rain amounts. Heavier totals a bit north of here, but the numbers are coming up across our state. Rain for the next seven days, one to two inches for the north, one half to one inch for the south. And a quick peek at the tropics. Let's not forget this is hurricane season. Things are very quiet across the Atlantic Basin. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the 06C run at 4 o'clock this afternoon. Troughing rotating through the northeast and again. Today should be sunny. High today, 83, 84, 85, something like that. Just very nice. Tomorrow looks pretty dry here in modeling. This is uh, off the GFS, but we will mention the chance of a shower over the southwestern part of the state. Most of Alabama dry. Highs mid to upper 80s. And then Sunday, moisture levels rise. There could be a few widely scattered showers or storms. Certainly not a rainy day. Otherwise, partly sunny highs in the upper 80s. And next week, looking pretty typical for summer. Uh, every day, this is Monday, there'll be a mix of sun and clouds with some chance of scattered showers and storms, most active during the peak of the daytime heating process, the afternoon and evening hours. There's Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Things not changing much. Highs mid to upper 80s. And a week from today, got a ridge over the Gulf, troughing to the north, and again, a few scattered showers and storms with some sun. Let's go out 10 days. This is Sunday the 23rd. Again, same pattern, ridging for the deep south, troughing up north, and again, very classic summer weather there. This is the expected rain coming off the European Ensemble. The mean about two and a half inches for the rest of June. And highs most days in the upper 80s to near 90, and lows mostly in the low 70s. This will be the last really cool morning for a while, probably until sometime in September. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes in the blog. I'll be out doing a live shot today, so no afternoon video. But if you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend, and God bless. Some things in life are just made to go together. Peanut butter and jelly, rock and roll, the sun and the moon. These things got Blake Sanders, the owner of KS Services, thinking. What can we pair with our superior heating and air service to make our customers even happier? Plumbing Experts by KS Services was born. So the next time you have a clogged line, leaky faucet, or water running all through the house, know there's a reputable company out there on call just to click away. Call KS.com, your trusted source for heating and cooling and now plumbing.